Hi, I'm Reagan. And I'm McKenna. And you're watching the JCNS TV News. On today's show, we'll hear some senior information, watch a movie review, and find out who's this week's Teacher of the Week. We just want to give a huge thank you to Jackson EMC for sponsoring the JCNS TV News. Panthers, remember finals are coming up, so make sure you are studying. Seniors, the signature sheet for exemptions is due tomorrow by the end of lunch. Seniors, make sure to transfer your school email and drive to a personal account by May 30th. Seniors, please pay attention to this video so you can learn the alma mater to sing at graduation. Hello. I am Mrs. Green and I am the course teacher here at Jackson County High School. This message is for our class of 2021. You will be singing the Jackson County High School alma mater at graduation as an entire class of students. So please listen and learn so you can sound great as you enter the next part of your life's journey. Thank you. On a Georgia's northern border, reared against the sky, proudly stands our alma mater as the years go by. Forward ever by our watchword conquer and prevail. Hail to thee. Let's take a look at this movie review by Jet Lopez. In this season's final movie review, we'll be looking at Zack Snyder's Justice League which was obviously directed by Zack Snyder and premiered in 2021. This movie is a notably significant case for the industry because it marks the first instance in film history in which a director has released an alternate cut of a film that was previously released under the creative control of another director. The film follows the same basic plot as the trash that was released in 2017, though it differs in that it is better in every way. Unlike the 2017 version, Zack Snyder's Justice League does not compromise character development for the sake of throwaway jokes and quippy dialogue. Been able to, like brunch, like what is brunch? In which it maintains the dark narrative style seen throughout the franchise. Thus, Snyder's keen eye for beautiful imagery is on full display in which this film employs some of the most visually striking cinematography and visual effects ever put to screen. The film also clocks in at four hours long, which provides plenty of room for character interaction and story development, though this may turn some heads in a negative direction. However, if you've ever binged a TV show, no one is going to take you seriously if you complain about the length. Regardless, the film's impressive visuals Breathtaking action sequences <laughs> and engaging narrative are enough to make this 240 minute experience worth anyone's time. Let's take a look at this week's Smarter Than a 5th Grader in a Senior video. What is that state? Utah? Missouri. That's Wyoming. Okay. Nebraska? Okay. Montana. Let's move on to the next state. <laughs> what about the one next to it? 
Nebraska. South Dakota. Nebraska? Uh, New York. <laughs> yeah. Okay, what is that one? Oklahoma. Wyoming? Okay. Uh, Oklahoma. Oklahoma. Mark Kansas. <laughs> what about that one? Ohio? Ohio. Minnesota. It's Illinois. Florida. <laughs> Look at the top right. Vermont. I'm going to say Vermont. New Hampshire. I want to say Maine. That's a state. Congratulations, guys. Wish you all luck next year as you venture off into the world. Good luck at college, good luck in the military, good luck in your jobs, whatever you choose to do. Wish you nothing but the best. Congratulations, class of 2021. Y'all have made it. Hope y'all have a great summer and good luck next year. Peace out, Girl Scout. You know the deal. Keep it real. Hi, you guys. I hope you have a great time in your future endeavors. Good luck. We're going to miss you. Bye. Congrats on making it through the easiest part of your life. Just kidding. Congratulations. We will miss you. We love you. Peace out. Congratulations to the class of 2021. You made it through a couple of rough years here, but you did it. And uh, buena suerte con todo. Congratulations, seniors. We're so excited for you and everything that you're going to accomplish in the future. You know where to find us if you need anything. And good luck. First and foremost, I would say that this, although this has been one of the most challenging years of all, I'll have to say it has been incredibly fun. Um, I love this class. It's probably been one of my most favorite senior classes of all time. No kidding. Um, I think the seniors this year put in a lot of work when they were present in class. They read a lot of books. They learned a lot. They got lots of new experiences in um, advanced composition. Dramatic writing was a new class for me this year. And those kids pretty much rocked it. They made me laugh almost every day, which is an important part of school. Thank you and have a great life. Seniors, especially the ones that I know, um, I'm gonna give you a piece of advice that I tell you from the time you're in my class from freshman to senior year. Find something that you love to do that you can make be your career and you will never work a day in your life. So that's my advice to you. Um, and um, I'm just going to miss all of you. Y'all have been such a great class. Y'all have managed to persevere in these crazy times we went through last spring and this fall. And hopefully things are getting back to normal and we can continue on. But um, y'all have really done a great job and I'm going to miss you all. So it's a little different for me this year because it's the first time I know the seniors. I saw them go all the way through from <clears throat> freshmen to uh, being graduating. And I'm, I'm just so proud of all the things that they've accomplished and the, the men and women they've become and I just couldn't be any happier to see them uh, move on and succeed and uh, meet, all, meet all their goals of graduating high school and, and I want them to continue on in whatever it is they, uh, they want to do in their life and I'm just so proud and happy of them. I'm going to miss you guys. Let's get into the worldwide news. Irish graphic designer Connor Foran has created a new font proudly shows what it is like to have a stammer. Foran himself had a stutter and he claims that the font is a positive reclamation of all of these negative things society says about stammered speech. Foran named the font Disfluent as a representation of the way he speaks. A new species of saber-toothed tiger has been discovered. Scientists believe there is just not one but multiple other types of saber-toothed feline genetic branches. This species would have lived between 5 and 9 million years ago. Based on the size of the bones, they have believed they have routinely taken down bison-sized and mammals. This makes the largest cat alive at the time. After seeing recent storms along the Jersey Shore, hundreds of diamondback terrapins have been being rescued from storm drains. 862 babies have been successfully rescued using a species special crafted tool at the Stockton University, caring for and rehabilitating them. There will be an estimate year before the turtles are well enough to be released. That will be all for the Worldwide News. Thanks for watching. Well, you know what time it is.
What's up? How does it feel to be Teacher of the Week? <laughs> teacher of the Week? Well, I don't feel deserving of Teacher of the Week. <laughs> we have so many amazing people in this building, but I'm grateful that uh, someone thinks I'm doing something okay this week. That's great. That's all for this week's show. I'm Reagan. And I'm McKenna. I'm Elizabeth. I'm Lily. And I'm Zoe. I'm Jet. And I'm Max. That's a wrap for season 10. And remember, it's, it's a great day to be a Panther. Rawr! Yeah!